I think the thing that makes this yellow card record unique um, is it's been such a different process. Um, you know, we were so involved with Ocean Avenue, Lights and Sounds, and even Paper Walls, we were, you know, living on an anthill. We were on top of each other all the time. Uh, we never really took any breaks from touring or anything like that. And right now, we uh, recording this uh, Yellow Card album. We just took some time apart, um, took some time off. Uh, we wrote a lot of material, which I think uh, proved to be really, really good for, for the band. Um, and we were flying to see each other and demoing songs, and we'd never ever done a record like that before. I think this record is actually, in some way, there's a couple of songs that I think are going to be probably more of a departure than anything the band's ever done in, in terms of just vibe almost. Um, and then on the other end of the spectrum, I think there's some really old school elements, some very energetic, very heavy stuff. So it's kind of an interesting spectrum that we're kind of exploring on it. You know, really this la this week is like my favorite, as crazy as it is. It's, it's like kind of when everything really takes on a life of its own and you start to hear stuff for the first time. And it's almost like you're taken back. Like I was doing a tambourine part and I got to hear some stuff in headphones that I hadn't heard and actually sounded kind of like it's a record. So as stressful as this time is to me, this is kind of the most fun. This record stands out to me in a way that it has this reminiscent feeling of, of one for the kids actually, our very first record we ever did. Um, because of the time we've had to make it and the method in which it was written and recorded, we're just recording it. That sounds awesome. Next part. And I think that you can hear that energy on the record. I really enjoy pre-production, like uh, everyone throwing out ideas and working together and like having the songs, you know, totally take a different shape. Uh, that's one of my favorite parts, I like the pre-production part. Um, getting guitar tones is always really fun for me, I'm kind of a nerd about recording and that kind of stuff, so I love just the process of doing it. Um, that's always one of my favorite parts of any recording. Strings getting played on our record is always one of my favorite moments to be there for. It's always been a, something I'm really proud of to be in this band is that Sean Mackin is in the band and writes all of our string arrangements himself. And we don't have to have someone come in to do that. And so watching him work on that and then hearing it come to life is always like, I mean, it's, to me, it's kind of the most exciting day in the studio. It's interesting because for me, I've been a fan up until now being a member. So I, I kind of got to come at the record. From that perspective, like what would I want to hear in a yellow card record? My favorite song, um, I do, I really like this song, Be the Young, that we've done. Um, the melody's really strong, uh, Ryan did a great job, uh, really came together well. Ryan Mendez actually came up with one of, I think, his one of his best guitar parts uh, to date. There's a song called, um, I guess we haven't decided exactly what it's going to be called yet, but See Me Smiling. And it was a song that we had an, an instrumental demo of that Ryan Mendez wrote most of the music himself in Arizona at his house in the studio and recorded it and sent the demo to everyone and everyone was really excited about it so we ended up working it up as, as a full yellow card song. I would say the bridge of that song is one of my favorite vocal moments or performances I've ever done. I think because the band's been away for a while uh, and we've had kind of all just walked away and kind of lived life for a couple of years and just examined what we wanted and coming back to it, I think there's a really fresh feeling to it. It definitely feels very much like a group own thing, like everyone is so involved in every aspect of it that I think everyone kind of takes more ownership of it than maybe some of the records in the past. I think the songs are, are incredible, like anything you would expect from a yellow card record. But well, we've been really, really focused and I think um, you know, the love child of that is to have a really cool yellow card record. And uh, I'm, I'm anxious to hear it. I hope you guys are anxious to hear it too. But my honest final thought is that I'm really proud of this one. And I think that we've all done the best work we've ever done individually and collectively. And I think that everyone who gets this record, if, if you're a fan of our band, you're really going to be happy with what we've done. And that's, you know, that's all we're trying to do.